Hey everybody, welcome to the Chord Potion Quick Start Tutorial. Chord Potion is a MIDI effect plugin that can transform your chord progressions into new riffs, melodies, arpeggios and harmonic phrases instantly. So let's take a look. I prepared a simple chord progression for you and it sounds like this. Now, as I told you, Chord Potion is a MIDI effect plugin and you will need to put it between your chords and your instrument. As soon as Chord Potion is active, it will transform your chords and send the new output notes to your synth. Let's take a look at Chord Potion now. I will start with some presets first. As you can see, we have a big list of presets. And I will take this one for example. Another one. Each time you press play in your door, Chord Potion will automatically record the output notes for you. As soon as you stop the door, Chord Potion will stop recording as well. If you want, you can drag and drop the generated MIDI file to your door then. As you can see, the MIDI file contains the same notes as Chord Potion played before. So how can you create your own patches? First, let's load the preset AAA in it. As you can see, Chord Potion consists of four different rows. The basic idea is this. You can load a different harmonic rhythm pattern for each row and Chord Potion will combine these patterns to create new output notes for you. Let's start with the chords row first. At the moment, the pattern is set to 4 steps beat. This means that the pattern will trigger all the input notes again and again on every beat. Now let's pick a different pattern. I will use 6 steps variation A. Let's listen again. Ok, so far we only used the chords row. But as I told you, we can use several rows at once. For example, let's load an arpeggio into the top row. Let's pick another pattern, like 12 steps, quick melody B. We can solo the row and listen to the output. For each row, you can change the velocity of the pattern, transpose the pattern up or down a few octaves and you can also change the speed. Another important setting, let's take a look at the mode box over here. Restart on chord change means that Chord Potion will restart the pattern each time a new chord comes in. Keep on running means that Chord Potion will repeat the pattern on and on as soon as you start the door. Chord Potion contains different ways to create randomized melodies. Each row contains two different effect slots. As you can see, we have a big list of effects over here. Each effect will change the pattern. Let's pick Add Notes for example. This effect will add additional notes to the pattern. When you work with randomization effects, you can click on Generate New Variation to create new patterns. Let's listen to a few examples. Let's click on Generate again. Of course, you can combine different effects with each other. 
For example, we can choose Remove Nodes M. Now Chord Potion will first add new nodes and then remove some of the nodes afterwards. There are also two global effect slots. These global effects will get applied to all the rows. I will use randomized node length 1 to 2 steps now. There is also another way to add some randomization. Scroll down the patterns list and you will find some patterns that start with random. I use random 8 steps. Check out the Chord Potion website for the full manual and additional tutorials. See you soon!